Hello friends. So it is now Wednesday, the second week of Advent, and the title for our devotion today is, His name is The Prophet. Acts 3, 22 is going to be the verse that we're going to look at together. So if you have your Bible, press pause and look up Acts 3, 22. If you don't have your Bible, well, that's no problem at all. Press pause, run and grab it, and bring it on back. Now, one thing I've forgotten to mention this whole time, if you don't have a Bible with you right now, um, no worries at all. I'm going to read this verse in a few moments, and if you have zero Bibles in your household, please contact me. It is my job, it is my joy to make sure that everyone has a Bible. So if you need one, you contact me, okay? Okay. So go ahead, press pause and do any of those things. I'll wait patiently. Okay, friends, are we all set? Me too. So Acts 3, 22 says this, the Lord, your God, will send you a prophet. You are to obey everything he tells you to do. Sometimes when people speak, it is important to listen. They may have special instructions to give or warnings that we need to hear, or maybe good news that will make us very happy. Sometimes when people speak, it is important to listen. Jesus has the best news of all. He tells us about God, which is what a prophet of the Lord is supposed to do. He tells us God's will for us, warns us against danger and evil, and tells us the good news God wants us to hear. He can even foretell the future. Those who trust in me will be with me in heaven forever. That's what Jesus told us. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, speak and help us to listen carefully. In your name alone we pray, amen. Amen. And now here are three questions for us to think about it after this video ends. So whether that's in your classrooms or whether it's um, in, your, um, in your family or just maybe with some friends that you're watching this with. How many people spoke to you today or yesterday? I bet it's a lot, isn't it? If I were to stop and think, I had a lot of conversations yesterday. So when I would think about how many people spoke to me today or yesterday, home, oh, that's a lot. Um, and then can you remember them all? No, I don't think I could remember them all. And then whose message was the most important? So think about those things. How many people talked to you yesterday? Can you name them all? And which message was the most important? I love you so much, my friends, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.